Now, one key aspect of AMT is what we call the DLCC engine or the dynamic life cycle costing. This is a unique engine that sits at the very core of AMT and drives all its key functionality. Now, this engine models and forecasts all the maintenance strategies of a given asset down to the component level, taking many inputs into consideration and calculating all the future occurrences for the entire life of the assets. Now, not only does it handle actual occurrences that have already taken place, but also it forecasts and handles all future occurrences, be them either ad hoc or planned occurrences linked to actual maintenance tasks, and all of that is done in real time. Now, these life cycle projections are continuously updated from a multitude of different data points. And the forecast of costs, labor, components, parts, availability, productivity, utilization, continuously updated as well. This provides a better visibility and a more proactive approach to asset management. A common question that we hear is, surely Excel can do this? In reality, a simple version of this dynamic life cycle cost engine can actually be done with Excel, but as soon as you need anything that's a bit more robust and scalable, you will run into difficulties. There is only so much that can be done with Excel. Now, a key aspect of this whole process is integration. Integration is absolutely critical. Um, static data that's loaded into spreadsheet-like systems, they have a tendency of becoming stale very quickly. So the solutions and organizations that we're trying to map here, they are performed obviously in real time. So why use data that's no longer valid to back up your hypothesis? Something as simple as expanding your current analysis to include fleets, plans, sites, and perhaps the whole company becomes unattainable if you're sticking to spreadsheets. Now, another spectre where AMT shines is the fact that you can analyze a multitude of different data points in a single system. You're not going to be spending time collecting data and cleansing data from a multitude of different sources. And at the same time, the holistic approach that AMT takes allows for reliability decisions to be taken into consideration. Uh, in other words, does this short-term decision that I'm taking right now, will it make sense in the long term? For instance, sure, I can reschedule this particular component replacement to be done a little bit earlier. But what's going to happen if the trend continues over time? What's the impact that I'm going to have in terms of cost and availability over the next five years? Also, how confident am I that this trend is actually continuing? In other words, am I trying to solve a problem right now only to be faced with potentially a bigger problem later on? And how can I be made aware of these future problems depending on the decisions that I make right now? There is always a very delicate balancing act and the DLCC provides this pivotal missing piece of the puzzle. And one of the key ways that this is achieved is by the instantaneous creation of multiple forecasts that highlight the impact that a decision made right now will have in six months, a year, two years, or throughout the life of the asset. This provides the users with a more comprehensive, detailed picture that not only focuses on the decisions that need to be made right now, but also the future impacts that these decisions will bring. So this whole process provides a tool that backs up potential decisions being made right now and putting them into the context of the consequences that are going to be coming up down the line. One of the things that we find is that the more the users rely on the tools provided by AMT, the more the patterns emerge that highlights what the key drivers are in terms of maximizing the availability of assets as an example and minimizing the costs. So in other words, what really matters in terms of uh, maintenance planning becomes clearer and clearer. In summary, and as mentioned earlier, the DLCC engine is actually unique to AMT and it sits at the very core of the solution driving all of its key functionalities. It's used by hundreds of different operations all over the world to achieve uh, a multitude of different outcomes. The ability to create instantaneous budgets, benchmark equipment, to model future purchases, to plan for the long term, and much more is available within AMT. And we'll be covering some of these key aspects in videos to come.